Tom Devlin's Monster Museum in Boulder City offers a living history of horror cinema. His new attraction, The Fright Zone, is perfect for all of you ghoul lovers. JC Fernandez is live with the tail. Ah, JC, is that you? <laughs> yeah, yes. This is, this, is my, this is my friend Kirsten, uh, zombie woman right here. Uh, Tom Devlin's Monster Museum is perfect for Halloween. And here's the man himself, Tom Devlin. Tom, how would you describe your museum and set up to someone? So our place is a place one of a kind that you can come and see screen used props like these puppets from the Puppet Master series to uh, one of a kind works of art like the killer clowns from the oh, yeah, space yeah, killer, over here. Yeah, I, I saw this movie. It's a scary movie. All these movies are scary. Uh, yep. This is the actual screen use or you made these yourself? These, these are just custom refabbed versions of the clowns and uh, the original heads were made for a mask company but the, uh, these guys right here are one of a kind. Let's walk around the corner here because you have, you have so much uh, to see here inside your museum and this is a uh, the back room here I like, I like a lot because these are kind of the characters that we're familiar with, right? Uh, yeah, we have here Halloween? Have, yeah, Halloween, Michael Myers. We have the Leprechaun, Ash from the Evil Dead. Uh, one of my personal favorites, Leatherface, right behind you here. And what's so great about this place, it, it is so Instagram worthy. You can walk through here, you can take pictures. I want to, because we got Jason back here. This is so cool. You come down here, you take a picture of Jason. It's so, so realistic, and it's, you post it on Instagram. It's the perfect thing to post with your friends! <sighs> And there's scares that happen inside the Monster, Meme, Monster Museum as well. Is this guy always back here or is he just kind of here hanging out for me? He is not always back here, but in October after 7 p.m. the lights go out and we uh, replace some of the displays with live monsters. So the monsters come alive at our uh, Nightmare at the Monster Museum. And my heart is now pounding because of that guy that's standing <laughs> back there to scare me. And what's great too is that we have our mask on, you have safety protocols in yeah, place as well. And come back here because we do have back here, this is kind of the Wes Craven room. Every room has a theme. Room. Yeah, yeah. So we have Freddy, of course, Pluto from the Hills Have Eyes, and Scream. This is all Wes Craven's work. Now come back to your, this is this museum is nonstop. Every time you come around a corner, there's something new. Come back this way, Lancey. Come around here. And what room is this back here? We, this is our zombie slash Stephen King room. So we represent all the George Romero zombies. We bridge the gap with Creep Show, which Stephen King and George Romero teamed on. And then, of course, we have Tar Man behind you from Return of the Living Dead, the greatest zombie film of all time. Now come out through here. This is the uh, enter. We're going to kind of leave the. Uh, Monster Museum itself and come into the lobby area. When you come inside here, in the lobby area, you have all kinds of Halloween stuff for sale as well. Yeah. And then coming up, we're going to head to the Fright Zone. The Fright Zone. That's our, uh, our gallery of fear, which is next door, and it is 100% scary Halloween walkthrough. I love it. Tom Devlin's Monster Museum. I'm sorry, you guys. My heart is racing from that scare that he had planted there for me. <laughs> but coming up, we're going to go check out the Fright Zone, and I'm sure I'm going to be scared at some point again. We'll send it back to you guys in the studio. Stay strong, JC. Stay strong. Well,